so I'm going now to <clears throat> some kind of beautiful tiny bridge. Uh, it's called Swim Water or a River Swim, if I'm not mistaken. It's not far away from where I live, so I wonder how it will look because on photos it looked really beautiful. Uh, the water was like bright blue color. So I'm going to see it in real life. And while I'm walking here is like very beautiful view on the mountains. And today is very pretty weather. It's uh, shiny, like sunny. Which is true luck because uh, previous weeks it was rainy, cold and cloudy. So look at that beautiful landscape. Also, it's not the first time that I see like a cross like this under the road. So I wonder what it means. I should google it because it's really interesting. I haven't seen anything similar so far in other countries or even in Batumi. So over there you can see this bridge and this place which is called River Swim and on the opposite side is River as well. It's quite a beautiful place. So, and very unexpectedly, uh, I discovered the cave here. Oh my god. It's pretty wide. I read about it. Um, here is like a stand about this cave and it said that here were found like remainings of the ancient people. Someone pooped here, which is not surprising at all. Syringes. quite slippery here. Yeah. So interesting, like, imagine people like hundred, hundreds of thousand years ago were living here, like escaping from the rain making maybe small fires here to warm themselves <laughs> and now I am here looking <laughs> at all the mess left from people but what can you do cold place here are quite a few like famous caves in Kutenisi region, but um, the problem is uh, with Georgia, I guess, is that the public transportation is uh, quite poor. I mean, there is a qu uh, public transportation, but um, you cannot find uh, it on Google Maps. It's just like, you know, uh, like, like talking to people you can find out that 
there's bus number blah 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 which goes to the blah 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 so in all the places like of nature like any sightseeing they are outside of the cities so to get there you need uh, to get by some kind of transport uh, so because public transport is uh, so poorly developed here uh, you need to get a taxi uh, by European and maybe American like ranges the prices for taxis are quite small but uh, I don't know for me like for Ukraine they're like their average prices like uh, I wouldn't say they're too small so uh, that's why it's a bit harder to to get to see all the interesting sightseeing if you don't have much money so when you come here you should expect to pay some amounts like quite big amounts uh, for the transportation for taxis here you can have services when you like oh my god uh, when you rent a driver for a day so he will get you to all the places wait for you while you are visiting them and take you back yeah so or tours like with the group of people they also will get you there and will bring you back on their transfer but and this is the difference that i see with europe I was in Latvia recently and the public transportation there is quite developed meaning that you can find uh, the way somewhere uh, on the Google Maps selecting directions and public transport and it will show you which number of bus or tram or even train you should get but this is not the case for Georgia So here's the bridge, but I'm, as usual, just scared to walk down because I'm afraid to fall. I don't know, maybe I'll go there, but I have like a backpack, which is quite heavy and I'm afraid that I will lost my balance and we'll fall right into this river so we'll see but the place is quite beautiful and it's quite high as you can see about Kutaisi is that here are many streets like this they're quiet not many people especially after Batumi